master of guarding content from Cleeter SV. Again, sub to his channel. Like his videos, guys, if you did. This one's called Iris just went and bought Sid on a nightly date. Oh, wait. Brought Sid on a nightly date? We're going on a fucking date with the Midgard Kingdom's princess? Okay, let's see it. Hmm. What do we have in common with Iris? Why the fuck is Sid going on a date with Iris in the fucking the, the Master of Garden? What? Was she always to stay? I've never seen this outfit from Iris. Yo, the game is crazy. What the fuck? This. What the fuck is this? Oh. See how all the girls fucking bend over like this for Sid? They do that so much. Scandalous? Only the scandalous is your fucking cleavage right now. What are you doing? Uh-huh. I think a lot of people would hate Iris less if they saw her like this once in the anime. I think a lot of people that are Iris haters straight up, they, they, they would be much more lenient on this character and not hate her so much if they saw her like this. You know what? I'm all of a sudden, the Midgur's kingdom is suddenly looking a lot peak. I don't know. <laughs> What's funny? What, what's funny? Okay. <laughs> so she hasn't been day drinking, but so that so she pretty much does day drink. I don't know. She feels light and giddy because of Sid, maybe, yeah? Hmm. That's not my hand you're grabbing. What do you mean it's much bigger than I expected? <laughs> Iris draws Sid's Excalibur. If Alexia were to interrupt this date right now, would she be upset at Iris? Would she like fight her to the death? Like what would happen? <laughs> Are we the bodyguard today? The fuck, I thought we were the bodyguard, but goddamn. You know what? All of a sudden, seeing Iris like this makes me hate her a lot less. Okay, the next one? New wanted to sleep with Shadow? Uh-oh. This girl's forehead is crazy. Like, straight up. I, like, I've been starting to realize it more and more. But, like, her forehead? Look at this stuff. Look at this shit. Her eyes start here. Like, and then there's this portion, but, this, but then the, that's, that's the start of the hairline. Like, look at all this stuff at the top of the head, too. Like, this is a fucking, this is not a forehead. This is a fucking six head. Why? What's the reason? Okay. Do you want me to be the pillow? I can be your pillow. You can cook an egg in Nu's forehead right now. Yeah, there's a surface area, and now the head's also gonna get super hot as she's talking to Sid. Go out! It's crazy to see other characters. Like, like for example, Alpha, you never see her smile or like be super vulnerable around other girls she's always like this like head mistress she's the leader so she always like has like a cold ruthless face knew it too she's like a muscle no sorry she's a sadist right you saw her talk to scale and Poe. you saw how like scary she is but in front of shadow everyone is like the same they all turn into just dead dead soft ooh, ooh girls in front of shadow it's crazy get a new pillow me i'm the pillow Memory foam, but personally, I like them booba pillow. Sleep next to each other? Oh. Yeah? This girl has a fucking fiance. That guy named Marco, but I, I think that stuff like got um canceled as soon as she joined Shadow Garden. 
now that I mentioned Shadus, we don't have a masochistic Shadow Garden member yet. Are you saying there is one in the light novel? Okay, next one is called Delta's Reaction after Shadow said he will be their enemy. Uh oh, Delta got immediately. Tails Wagon. Bosu, Bosu. Hello. <laughs> It'd be funny if this is after she killed Black Jugga Jugga. You are that strong. I'll be the enemy? I don't know. Does she want to spar? Peace is best. I don't think Delta wants peace. There will always be evil. Yeah, okay. Then I'll fight you. Yeah, fight her. Wrestle her. Oh, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Technically, Super Elito Agent did fight Delta. That fight sequence, even though it lasted like five seconds, it was cool. Yes, you want to play roleplay? I'll be the bad guy. Wait, boss? You're going to be a bad guy? Wait, hold up. If you become a bad guy, that means I'm still on your side. Wait, how lucky me. Delta is just so... Uh, she's just too innocent and pure. Whoa! Hey, hey, hey! What is this? Is this a Halloween event? Did I miss out on something from Master of Garden? Doesn't this imply that as Christmas shows up, she's going to have like a Christmas outfit too? God damn. It's so crazy how like, you know, Delta's encounter with John Smith was so wholesome, you know? Delta was got Delta even got to understand like the tr actual truth. Now Delta's all happy. She got sent to after Black Jugga Jugga. Everything is happy. But then the encounter with Alpha, she's like fucking sobbing and crying. Just throw her off the fucking train. She's like, please don't abandon me. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Delta is the closest to Shadow in every Shadow Garden member. That's probably never going to happen because that would mean... Well, how is Eminence and Shadow going to end? Like straight up. How, how is this series going to end? Like, defeating the Cult of Diablos may be an abstract large goal at the end of the day, but, like, I just don't feel like we're rushing towards it. We're just chilling. We're just enjoying the world here. I don't think the end is, like, what people are, like, even thinking about. That's super cute. You can be dumb near Delta because Delta's dumber. Technically, it, it is pretty much dumb and dumber, huh? Where did Diablos come from? I'm not really sure. I'm sure it relates to someone like Aurora and also the three heroes, right? That we're learning a little bit more about, right? Like, um, what's her name? Freya, the human hero. We got, um, you know, fucking, uh, we got, we, we got, to Alex, uh, you know, the elf hero that we already met and the beast hero that we'll meet soon. We get disbanded? No, you wouldn't disband it, right? Oh, the Delta's gonna just become a household pet after we beat the Garden Man. Uh, after we beat Call of the Diablos. All right, next one. The reason why Elizabeth didn't join Shadow Garden. Hmm. Okay, what the fuck is this? Why is she walking down? Okay, I know that this is like an elegant way to like walk. I don't, I don't know, present yourself if you're like a lady back in the day, right? You want to tilt the skirt and like do a little little bow, but like from down, from this angle, coming down the stairs. Hello, Elizabeth. Miyuki. That's right, her haven, right? It's like a safe place for everybody. Shadow Garden could be that too. Human. Elf. The three factions. Cult of Diablos. Vampires too, you can join? I'll be your haven. Except I always end up left out somehow. I think that's on you. You just you're just boosting your chuny shit. 
Wanna join? Oh. Yeah. Imagine we fucking rip her clothes off to Lambda does that shit. Not the burger wrapper. Did you guys see that? 665 was there. 665 was in season one. Did you see that? Look, 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 look. For a split second, she's there. Watch, watch, watch. See, and she's still eating something. Isn't that crazy? Even in season one, she was hinted and teased and all her defining characteristics of like this funny, goofy, just like blonde girl that's just always eating. She's great. I still don't know what her name is. Lambda getting a shout out from Elizabeth. Wow. Alpha, I think, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Master of Garden Alpha. Ooh. Alpha really didn't meet Elizabeth, huh? Would that meeting actually happen? Imagine this is setting up for something in the anime. I just don't see Elizabeth coming into the story back. Like, how is she gonna be reintroduced? And actually, Elizabeth and Alpha met at the pool episode, technically. Maybe. Okay, bye. こうしてたまに設定に付き合いに来てくれる。みんなあなたのことは好いていると思うのだけれど。But oh, I think that's just the author intentionally doing that so the shadow can also always be, you know, doing his own thing while, you know, the shadow garden does this shit. Always a great videos to watch from Master Garden content from Cleeter SV.